everybody, this is Brad, uh, here in your local alder thicket with something else that I think is pretty cool to show you guys. So now that the snow has kind of melted off, there's still some ice, we've got some curious friends that are uh, showing up in these swamps. Oh, that guy's about to crawl out. Look at that. So we're, we're looking for ooh, little clusters of leaves that got pieced together by these little guys. I hope you can see that. I've got two of them here. They make their little homes, and then they can move around with their shelters on their back, almost like a hermit crab. But this is a native insect, oh wow, called a caddisfly. And I'm holding them right here in my hands because I know what caddisflies eat, and fortunately, caddisflies do not eat people. They're uh, strictly vegetarians, they decompose uh, the stuff, oh, there he goes. They decompose the stuff that's accumulating uh, down underneath the water here so they're fully aquatic and we can spot a couple of them I don't know there's another one right down there he's got a little home there's quite a few they're really starting to, to come out there's another one right underneath the water these guys are both out saying hello to me so they play a really vital role with uh, our ecosystems they take these dead leaves and they chew them up and they eat some of it and some of it just gets left to settle on the floor of the pond or the vernal pool or even the stream that they happen to be living in. And that makes it available for other things to come across. Maybe an even smaller bug can come across that same piece of a leaf, nibble a piece off and, and keep breaking down all of these things. If we didn't have animals like the caddisfly, then we would just have uh, ponds completely filled with dead leaves. And uh, within a couple of years, they would just completely fill up with uh, organic matter just because nobody's out there eating it. So we're gonna thank these guys and put them right back in the water. We really appreciate what they're doing. I'm glad they actually popped out a little bit to say hi to us today. Uh, just a good good animal all around, even though they're a little bit creepy crawly. That guy's still coming out of his case there.